So I'm going to show you how to change the default settings in Word so that your business letter doesn't end up looking like this. So this is wrong. There's too much space here between the date and the address. There should not be a blank line between the lines of the address. And there's too much space here and too much space here. Now I'm going to turn on the Show Hide button up here, which is this backwards capital P button, so we can see the behind the scenes formatting. Now you can see that I did correctly press Enter four times after the date. So I press Enter here and these three times as well. But the reason we're ending up with too much blank space here is because of the default settings in Word. I'm going to open up this paragraph dialog box and show you that by default, Word inserts eight points of line spacing after each paragraph. That's how we're ending up with all this extra space. So to fix this, we need to change the defaults. And we're going to do that by going in and revising the normal template. So right here in the styles group, you'll see this button for the normal template. If I right click on it and then left click on modify, this dialog box opens up. Down here at the bottom, I want to click on the format button and then choose paragraph. Then I want to change that eight points of line spacing after each paragraph to zero points. I'll click on OK. And then the last step, and this is really important, is to click this radio button, New Documents Based on this Template. From now on, every single new Word document that I create will reflect these changes, but only if I click on this radio button. Last thing I'm going to do before I finish here is I'm going to change the font size to 12. 11 point font is too small in my opinion for people that wear reading glasses. So I would go ahead and change to 12 point font. And if you don't like Calibri, maybe you might want to choose Times New Roman or some other font for your letters. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it on Calibri and finish by clicking OK. And now you can see that the spacing is fixed. I just have three blank lines here after my date. I've removed the blank lines between the lines of my address and everything else is proper now.